Hey there, happy Friday. So I'm about to get on my mama soapbox because this is a great lesson, not just for kids, but I feel like us adults too. And here's the lesson, take ownership. All right, so here's the story for you. A couple weeks ago, I hosted my Social Connect Simplified and it was everything that I imagined. Some of you who have followed my journey know that I have this Social Connect Phoenix event and it was so much work and a big production and I always left feeling exhausted. I never felt like I actually got to connect with the people at the event because I had given myself a J-O-B. And now it is so simplified. I literally walked in to this happy hour with my bag of pretzels, my sign, threw it down and went to go have a beer <laughs> and just hung out with all of these good people that were there. Well, so Weeks later, I'm starting to hear from some people that are like, dang it, I missed it. Oh my goodness, you should have reminded me over and over that it was coming. And I'm like, okay, let's see. I posted it, I email blasted it, I shared it. I also have a socialconnect.world community, so I invited people to that. But it's not my responsibility to always keep tabs on where you're at and keep sending reminder after reminder after reminder. So I was talking to my good friend Jay about this yesterday, and he's like, you know what, Tisha? People need to take ownership. It is not your responsibility. If I want to go to something, I put it on my calendar immediately. If I want to do something with a friend, I put it on my calendar immediately. And I think that's that's my nature too. If it's something that's so important to me and a priority, I put it on my calendar because I look at that like it's gold. So if that's you, if you're like, gosh, I wish I would have known and I wish you would have told me, it's really not anyone's responsibility but yours. So take ownership, do that thing you need to do to make sure you get there and to just remember that it's coming, right? So that's my little soapbox lessons in my Lexus for this week. I hope you have a great weekend and an early th uh, Valentine's Day of uh, spending it with the, uh, the ones you love. And I'll catch you back in another lessons in my Lexus next Friday. We'll see ya.